A couple is in jail accused of having sex inside St. Patrick's Cathedral, apparently as part of a radio stunt. Brian Florence and Loretta Harper allegedly were caught inside a vestibule in the church. They are charged with public lewdness, and Paul Mercurio was arrested for recording the sex act. Well, it was supposed to be something of a stunt for a local radio station, but it wasn't very funny to New York police who arrested a couple for having sex inside St. Patrick's Cathedral. Police say the couple was observed having intercourse in a church vestibule. The 37-year-old man and 35-year-old woman, both from Virginia, were arrested for public lewdness. A man from the Upper East Side was also arrested for allegedly recording the act. It was later played on a local radio station. This is UPN 9 News. Tonight, sex at St. Pat's. A naked couple, a lewd act in the back of the church, and now sources say it was all part of a radio prank. Good evening, everyone. I'm Brenda Blackman. And I'm Frank Cipolla. Roland is off tonight. And tonight we begin with a story many are calling disgusting, despicable. A couple having sex inside of one of New York's most sacred shrines, St. Patrick's Cathedral. And worse than that, why they did it. Sources say it was a radio stunt. Judy Chavez is live at St. Pat's with a story for us this evening. Judy. Good evening, Brenda. Today is a holy day. It's the feast of the Assumption of the Blessed Virgin Mary. And tonight, many parishioners are in disbelief that a shameful stunt would take place here. Pretty horrified to hear that because uh, I'm, I'm a Catholic. I'm part of the New York Diocese. And uh, to hear something like that is, is uh, pretty intense. Outside St. Patrick's Cathedral, Catholics and non-Catholics were wondering why an out-of-town couple would pick this holy spot to engage in sexual intercourse. It's so many places that they could go and do whatever they wanted to do without being in the Church of God. Police sources say the sex act was a radio show stunt for the Opie and Anthony program. Police say one person was standing next to the couple with an open cell phone so the act could be recorded. Very, very disgusting and, and just something that's not acceptable. Police say a priest or a church worker apparently made the discovery. That person thought the man was urinating in the vestibule, but as he got closer, it turns out he saw a naked couple. Cops arrested 37-year-old Brian Florence from Quantico, Virginia, and 35-year-old Loretta Lynn Harper from Alexandria, Virginia. Investigators also picked up 42-year-old Paul Macorio. He was allegedly carrying the open cell phone. I'm amazed that someone will think to even go to this place to do something like this. I'm appalled by this. And all three will spend the night in jail, two charged with public lewdness, one charged with acting in concert for allegedly holding the cell phone for the Opie and Anthony radio show. We are live here from St. Pat's. I'm Judy Chavez, UPN 9 News. Frank? All right, thank you, Judy.